Valerie, uh, and there's everything from <laughs> diamonds, rubies, bronze figures, there's four, the and the Phantom, mm -hmm. the Rolls Royce. <laughs> Good morning, Bill. On the road again. I just can't wait to get on the road again. Hey, this is a 2008 Phantom Rolls Royce, Rolls Royce Phantom that has been driven only once through the PJ's drive through in Gretna. It has been sitting on a cushion of love and it is ready for you. Now, when this baby was brand new, Adam Wolf Lambert from Crescent City Auction Gallery, it went for about half a million dollars, right? Uh, right, a quarter quarter million. And how many miles does she have on her? So this one only has roughly about 30,000 miles, even though it's a 2008. Now, I don't know anything about cars or anything else if you've seen me on TV, but I do know that when you go car shopping, oh, sorry, you should look under the hood. Can we, I don't want to insult the owner, but can we look under the hood? Absolutely, right, look, under look under this under hood. hood. Hood check on St. Charles Avenue. You could eat off Whoa. Of that engine. How is this kept so clean? The owners just go above and beyond to make sure that the vehicle is meticulously cared for uh, throughout ownership. It's one of the you know pride and joys of most Rolls Royce owners. And, and I like that there's a label for engine oil. Rolls Royce has come from England. I, I think I've heard that the wood that's used in the, in the cabinet, in the dash, there's a special forest in England where they grow it. You mentioned that all fair. I don't know. I'm going to have to fact check that soon. Can we? <laughs> you better fact check me too. Can we take a look inside? Okay, Absolutely. under the hood looks nice and clean. I want to see what the front seat looks like in case I want to balance my Fabergé egg somewhere in there. What are we looking at here? Absolutely. This is extraordinary. Yeah, so it, it, full interior. Now, a lot of people that uh, own Rolls Royces will ride in the back, not in the front. But if you were to drive it, it's... You mean they'll be driven? They will be driven, absolutely. But <laughs> It's it, driving me crazy. I don't know about you. It's a fantastic driving experience. Look at the interior cabin. And come see this. I'll show you the back. All right. This is this where... This is the back. This is the famous Rolls Royce umbrella here, where you pull out the umbrella. And I'm not going to force it right now, but um, this is the. That's back. an umbrella that that you use when it rains every day. You use when it rains, or to shield you from the paparazzi as you get out of your vehicle. <laughs> I love that, and I would bet you that a car like this, when the streets of New Orleans flood, it would probably turn into a yacht. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't want to find out. I wouldn't either. All right. So what else in here that is a I can't believe they put that in a car kind of moment. The the cleanliness. So of the, this the car. cleanliness, absolutely. The back does have double LCD screens, which are tucked away now, but they will come out, and so that you can watch TV from. And the of back. course, you're going to be watching WGNO Good Morning New Orleans, right? Or you're going to be watching the auction <laughs> live in real time, bidding from your smartphone. You can. So you don't even have to come down here, LBJ and Amy. I mean, that's the way the kids do it these days. On, can you do it from your cell phone? Absolutely. You can download the Crescent City Auction Gallery app and you can bid live in real time. You can even watch it like you're watching television. Can you believe these wheels? Thank you, Adam, for joining us this morning. This is a, look at it again. Nice. This Very cool. It's not every day you see one of those. of a ride. That car is so nice, it would make you forget we 